we have the balanced chemical equation, now we can do the complete ionic, and this is really what I want to drive home. In complete ionic equations, you break apart, dissociate everything that has aqueous, with one exception, weak acids and weak bases. So I come to HF, and this is what you'll see on a test that will trick students. This is weak. It's not one of our seven strong acids. It does not completely 100% ionize. Do not dissociate it. Even though it has aqueous, don't break it apart. So you've got two HF aqueous. Okay, you keep that together. Now, um, everything else is aqueous, I can dissociate. This calcium chloride, it is um, an ionic compound that's soluble, is going to completely dissociate. Uh, and I had a calcium two plus and two of the chloride ions yields. I'm going to, let's see, do the hydrochloric acid. It's a strong acid, 100% is going to ionize. So this will be two H plus, and that's also aqueous, plus two Cl minus. You can see, yeah, you can see that aqueous plus, ooh, check that out right there, solid. Solids, liquids, gases, we don't dissociate. So that is going to be calcium fluoride solid. Now, we're going to find spectator ions. Anything that's the same on both the reactant and product side. So I take a look, and the only ion that I can see that's a spectator ion is the two chlorides. Those two chloride ions, those are going to be the spectator ions. So to write the complete, or excuse me, the net ionic, let's put a note. This was the complete, and this is going to be the net, net ionic. So here's the balanced chemical reaction, complete ionic. Now I've got my net ionic. This is going to be whatever's left over, two uh, moles of the hydrofluoric acid plus one mole of the calcium ion yields two moles of hydrogen ion plus one mole of a calcium fluoride solid. And that is our net ionic equation. What trips up kids is that right there because it has aqueous. Um, so memorize that list of strong acids, strong bases, and when you have to do a net ionic, if you have an ester or base, so something with hydroxide or something with hydrogen, that's not on those two lists, the seven strong acids, the eight strong bases, do not break it apart. Okay, good job. Have a good day.